Hi friends, it's Mrs. Barnum. I'm gonna teach you a new Valentine song and it's called Love Somebody. So I want you to listen as I sing the song for you. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, but I won't tell who. Okay, I want you to listen again. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, but I won't tell who. All right, one last time listening. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, but I won't tell who. Okay, now it's your turn to learn the song. So I'm gonna sing a little bit, and then when I point to you, it's your turn. Ready? My turn first. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, but I won't tell who. All right, let's try it again. My turn. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, but I won't tell who. All right, that sounded really good. So now we're gonna do it together. All right, are you ready? Here we go. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, but I won't tell who. All right, now friends, if you have some pink or red paper, maybe you guys can cut out a heart and you can play a little game with this song. So there are two ways to play this game. The first way is that you can hide the heart somewhere in the room and then you're gonna sing the song and the person who's looking for the heart, if they're getting closer, then you sing louder. But if they're getting farther away from the heart, then you sing softer. So for example, if I put my heart over here, ooh, it kind of blends in, doesn't it? And let's say my person is walking this way, who's searching for the heart. Let's see if I can make it a little bit better. Okay, so let's say my heart is over here and my person is looking for the heart. Then I would sing, love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, but I won't tell who. Okay, and so as you could see, as my fingers got closer, that represented the person looking for the heart. If my person looking for the heart is getting closer, then I have to sing louder so they know that they're getting close. But if I move further away, then they have to sing softer, okay? So how about we practice that? If I bring the heart closer to you, you're gonna sing louder, but if I bring it farther away, Okay? All right, let's kind of start in the middle. Ready? Here we go. Love some. I did it wrong, didn't I? Let's try it again. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, yes I do. Love somebody, but I won't tell who. 
right, let's try one more time. Ready? Here we go. Love somebody so deep. Love somebody so deep. Love somebody. Yes, I do. Love somebody, but I won't tell who. That was pretty good. Okay, the other way that you can play this game is that if you're at home with your family, you have everybody sit in a circle. And then one person holds the heart in their hands like this. And then everybody else closes their eyes and opens their hands like this. And the person holding the heart goes around to each person while they sing the song. And then you decide who you're gonna drop, whose hands you're gonna drop the heart into. Okay, and everyone keeps their eyes closed and at the end of the song, everybody closes their hands and they have to try to figure out who has the heart. Everyone has to try to figure out who they think has the heart. And the person who has the heart has to be tricky and pretend like they don't have the heart, okay? So you can either play the loud, soft version or you can play the circle version, okay? So everybody sits in a circle and then I would sing the song, let's say that I'm it and I go around and everyone closes their eyes. Everyone in my circle closes their eyes and holds out their hands like this. And then while I'm singing the song, I might drop it. I drop it into somebody's hands. And then at the end of the song, love somebody, but I won't tell who. Everybody closes their hands. And then we have to try to guess who has my heart. And then the person who has the heart gets to be the new person in the middle. Okay, so I hope you get to play this fun Valentine's game about who we love. And I hope that you're able to share some love with your family or with your friends by singing this song or playing this game. Have a great time.